Hi everyone. Today we're going to study a statistical hypothesis, and this is part one. As defined, a statistical hypothesis is an assumption about a population parameter. This assumption may or may not be true. There are two types of statistical hypothesis for each situation. The first is the null hypothesis. The second is the alternative hypothesis. Null hypothesis is denoted by H sub 0. States that there is no difference between assumed and actual value of a parameter. While alternative hypothesis is denoted by H sub 1, states that there is a difference between assumed and actual value of parameter. Take note that H sub 0 and H sub 1 are mutually exclusive and only one can be true. A statistical test uses the data obtained from a sample to make a decision about whether the null hypothesis should be rejected. The numerical value obtained from a a statistical test is called the test value. Examples of a statistical test are t-test and z-test. Let us now define one-tailed or two-tailed tests. A one-tailed test is either right-tailed or left-tailed depending on the direction of the inequality of the alternative hypothesis. For the right tail test and the left tail test, here are the pairs of hypotheses that will come. For the right tail test, we have the null hypothesis H sub 0, and this is mu equals k. This mu is the population mean, and the k is any value. And h sub 1 will give the idea that mu is greater than k. While the left tail test, the null hypothesis will give the same mu equals k. While the alternative hypothesis H sub 1, this is given as mu is less than k. In figure, this is the left tail test. By the word itself, the left tail of the normal curve is being shaded. While the right tail test, the right tail here is being shaded. On the other hand, a two-tail test is there when the inequality of the alternative hypothesis is not equal. Problem will come to you like this. The hypotheses are paired accordingly as the null hypothesis mu equals k while the h sub 1 mu is not equal to k. This not equal sign here gives us the idea of a two-tailed test. It means both tails are being shaded. Let us have more definition of terms. A type 1 error 
is the rejection of null hypothesis when it is true. The significance level of the test is the maximum probability of committing a type 1 error. This probability is symbolized by alpha. In symbol, P of type 1 error equals alpha. The significance level alpha is usually set at 5%, 1%, or 10%, and it is decided before the test is conducted. We say that this error can be controlled. A type 2 error occurs if one does not reject the null hypothesis when it is false. The probability of this error cannot be decided before the test is conducted. We shall continue this lecture of statistical hypothesis on the next video. I hope you learned something from this video. See you again next time.